Honda built the NC1 NSX with both a combustion engine and three electric motors. Those motors are driven by a battery pack. But where did the battery pack come from? How long does it last? The answer to the first question is, it came from a company called Blue Energy. The Japanese company is dedicated to the development and manufacture of automotive lithium ion batteries. So it looks like Honda outsourced its battery needs. Or did it? It turns out that Honda, along with Japanese battery giant GSU Asa, created Blue Energy in 2009. And GSU Asa is a giant. It works with Mitsubishi, absorbs some of Panasonic's battery business, and has stakes in India, Thailand, Hungary, China, and other countries. So when Honda teamed up with GSU Asa to create Blue Energy, it wasn't by accident. In fact, Honda has used Blue Energy batteries in many of its vehicles, but the NSX is definitely the coolest to be powered by electric. The four battery modules in the NSX battery pack are the EHW5 model. Each module contains 18 cells, which are 17% lighter and 7% smaller than conventional cells, yet they produce the same or greater performance. Each cell has a capacity of 5.0 amp hours and 3.6 volts. Combined, the pack has 1.8 kilowatt hours. Blue Energy boasts that the EHW5 has a strong performance over a wide variety of temperatures and that it is highly durable. It can surpass 10 years and 50,000 cycles. What do those numbers actually mean? Well, we're all pretty familiar with years, so I'm just going to skip over that one. But what is a cycle for a battery? A cycle occurs each time the battery is fully discharged, but that doesn't have to happen in one session. For example, if a battery is drained by 70% in one session and recharged, then drained by 30% in a second session and recharged, that adds up to one full cycle of 100% discharge. But according to EV Engineering's website, the level of discharge can also impact how many cycles a battery can handle. The deeper the depth of discharge, the fewer cycles a battery can last overall. A battery that is regularly discharged by 30% before charging will last longer than one that is regularly drained by 70% before charging. We don't know what level of discharge Blue Energy used in its calculations of 50,000 cycles, but 50,000 seems like quite a lot. On top of that, the regenerative design of the NSX means that each time the driver brakes, power is pumped back into the batteries, restoring the discharge in real time. So how do you take care of the battery in your NSX? The owner's manual states that you should drive the vehicle for at least 30 minutes, at least once every three months. But if you have a car as awesome as this, I'm sure that you will drive it much more frequently and keep that battery in great health. Thank you for watching.